Hello, welcome to another episode of Whiskey Crusaders. Today, I am Matt, and we are going to be doing a cool experiment from our buddy Knight, who has decided to make us a poor man's pappy blend. And we're going to do it over a four-week time period. And so what he's done, mostly we will combine Weller Antique, which is obviously this nice one here in the red label, and the beautiful Weller 12 here. This being 90 proof and the Antique being 107 proof. So what he made was a 3 to 2 ratio of uh, Antique to Weller 12. So the way he poured it, and there was 300 milliliters of the Antique, then 200 milliliters of Weller 12, then 150 of the Antique, and then another 100 of Weller 12. Then mix them together, shook it vigorously, let it sit for a week. So this is one week's worth. So we're going to pour it here, see what we think of a week, and then we're going to revisit this every week for four weeks and see if it changes, it stays the same, just to see how mar the basically the effects of marrying are, see how close they're at the very end. Compare it to an actual Pappy 15. So that should be a lot of fun. So let's see what we think here of it. All right. Uh, of course, if you already like Weller, you're already going to love this anyway. I mean, Tony Weller 12 more and Tea together, both fabulous bourbons. Can't go wrong with them. We've reviewed both of them. So we, you know, we'll, we'll link both of those reviews at some point at the end of this video as well. But let's see what we think just of this one week old blend at this point in time. And so then Will and Sarah will also be tasting this as well and let us know what they think of it. All right, so what I'm getting on here is it smells super oily and rich. Some chocolate, some orange. Mm, it smells like Weller. It does smell like Weller. <laughs> Higher proof, wheater. Mm -hmm. It's got that wheat sweet. Mm -hmm. Cherry, some new leather, a little bit of oak. Uh, Vanilla. Corn dominant for sure. Cinnamon, brown sugar. Nutmeg. Mm hmm This is more cherry forward than it is apple. It really is. Butterscotch. Oak. Mm-hmm. Barrel spiced oak, like a, the charred oak. Yeah, it, I'm getting a little bit of like a pencil shaving type of wood note. Mm-hmm. Smells good. Smells about a little shoe polish. Okay. All right. So let's do going. That's pretty much I think all I'm at this moment. Let's go in for the taste. Mm-hmm. 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 Good. Good. Um, it's rich and oily. It's a little disjointed. It kind of feels like, which I think is, you know, just being a, a week being married in there. Mm. Things are kind of a little bit disjointed here. They really are. It's it's not cohesive and round. Mm -hmm. um, I can pick out the two. Mm -hmm. I can pick them out distinctly. It's been sitting for a week still. You would think that they would marry at least a little bit. Mm -hmm. That you wouldn't be able to pick out each individual. No. Um, yeah, but you get the proof spike for the 107 up front. And it kind of rounds and smooths for a moment and then the proof spike again kind of swells uh, at the right. end. Right, so it's like it. 107, 12, 107. Yeah. Um, it is warm. It is nice and warm, which you know should be with antique being 107. A um, little butterscotch, oak, vanilla, um, chocolate sprinkles, um, a little bit of whipped cream, um, chocolate-covered cherries, some orange. Is that, now this is more a little warm leather on the taste, some, uh, Furniture polish. It's good. Still good. It's good. Yeah. Um, I get a lot of the wood tannins on the palate. Um, the almost like a the char of the twelve. And maybe even just a little bit of sprinkle of apple. Yeah, that's good. Mmm. Ah, oh, it's good. But like I said, I think um, when the marriage goes together, we'll see here in week two. We try it again next week when we film this. So we think. So uh, it's going to be a little short little series when we do this and see what you guys think. So, uh, so once again, thank you, Knight, for making this. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next episode of Crusaders. And I'm sure Will will do the lovely uh, cheers out for this. So cheers, everybody. And we'll see you guys next time. Cheers. <laughs>